Okay, for anyone that's interested, uh, the 2011 and earlier IMAX, where you could take the stand off of the machine, which I took mine off. There's videos online to show you how to do it. Anything 2012 and later will not allow you to do that. This iMac I bought online at eBay has a bent stand. It's got a it's got a broken corner, which wasn't in the description. But anyway, the people offered to give me a partial refund, so I'm not real concerned. But anyway, the whole reason for doing this was because I travel a lot and I need to carry this around. And I've got a gator rolling case coming for it, which is really nice, which I'll show later. But I did want to show you that I purchased three different stands to just set this up uh, wherever you go. I mean, this, you'd be able to just carry this in its case without the stand and carry just a little stand to put it on like these. The first one we're trying here is called the Acoustic Gig Stand from D and A. DNA. Lifetime guarantee works with any acoustic guitar, which I got guitars, but uh, I got these for the specific purpose of trying these stands when carrying my 27 inch iMac around, which I'm sure you could put on the new ones if you can, if you're good enough to get the, take it all apart and get the uh, stand off of it, carry it around, uh, because Apple doesn't want you to. Uh, they're sitting around the boardroom table figuring out how to jerk, suck more pennies out of your pocket. So. Um, this particular first stand we're looking at here, the DNA, uh, is, as you can see, uh, it's just, I'll show you a minute how they all fold up, but this, this one here in particular, this is very, very, I mean, it sits there, it's not a big deal, and, and you'll be able to, uh, move it in and out and lean it, change it around, but I did want to show you that this is, this is, I mean, it's, it's fairly sturdy fairly sturdy but as you can see the bottom of it wobbles a little bit but I mean it's it's it is what it is um, and I'll show you here in a second how this folds up okay this is the stand and it folds up and it pull up this and it closes and it um, yeah. all right so that's it if you can carry it around it's about a it's a little more than a foot long, probably 13 inches long. This one is the yeah, the DNA, the DNA acoustic gig stand. That's your iMac 27 inch on this stand. Okay, this next stand we have is the F Zone S9 Universal Stringed Instrument Stand. Uh, this is uh, adjustable and it collapses a little smaller. But on this stand, it is really, really uh, not very sturdy at all. And as you can see, this back arm, it's not sturdy at all. I'm not real sure about leaving it on this table with my one hand. Um, and I'll show you here how it's adjustable. So, it is completely adjustable. Um, Make it uh, a little smaller there at the top, and then the back legs go in. And then, but the, these here can be moved back and forth to adjust, but it's still it's still pretty pretty wobbly. I guess those won't go in, but they will fold up, and it folds up nice and neat like that. Uh, if you use it for guitar, which I'll use it for guitar as well. Um, yeah, it's, it is it is what it is. Um, I wouldn't keep my iMac on it. But this is the uh, F-Zone S9 string instrument stand. And next we have the Pocket Titan Smart Guitar Stand by Ibanez. This is the Pocket Titan P32. Uh, of course, they give you the measurements in millimeters, which you'll have to go and. Uh, but this is the smaller of the three, and the most sturdiest of the three. That ain't going anywhere. And this, but I mean, this is this is just. I mean, it won't be adjustable. 
you won't be able to adjust this backward or forward unless unless you like put something on the front maybe under the feet raise it up a little bit you know but anyway this is the pocket titan from Ibanez which is the I mean which is just the best the sturdiest of all three of them so if you want to take the leg off your stand off your iMac carry it around with you put it in a case put it in a bag without the stand I would get this little Titan that's that's my recommendation the pocket Titan by Ibanez so we had which I'll show you here how this one folds up and there's this one this pocket Titan which is very simple it goes up in the center and you fold the legs in and it folds like that that's it that's all there's to it <laughs> so super sturdy good for your electric or wide body guitar it's, it's about two inches wide and it's got nice rubber plastic rubber coating on it to protect your surface so uh, this is the shoulder up and pocket tighten okay so we have all right I'll show you that. I have number one we have the pocket tighten and then we have this as you can see I'm going to show you next to these the DNA acoustic gig stand and we have the F zone S9 which is this piece here Oh, there's the F zone, the DNA, and the Titan. And this one is plastic and wobbly and just, oh, I, I, I don't even know if I'd trust my guitar on that one. It is so, so unsturdy. This one is number two. This one is selection number two. I doubt I'd use this one for even a guitar stand. I'll probably, I'll probably sell that. This DNA, it's next, it's good, it's it's a little big. Well, a little bigger than what I would choose. Uh, to carry on my iMac, set my iMac on, this job right here. This one right here is what I would do. And if I would want to, you know, if you want to um, maybe tilt your iMac a little back a little bit, which I mean, which is not a big deal. I would get maybe a board to set this front feet on. And you can angle your iMac back a little bit. But for an electric guitar, for a iMac, I would choose this set. This, this right here, that's that's the best of all three. Number one. Second place comes in the DNA acoustic kick stand, which I use that for acoustic guitar. And it's nice and sturdy. This one here, I wouldn't put anything on. Don't get that. All right, friends and loved ones, there you are.